Hello, Lisa. My name is Becky Box, and uh, I'm studying here at UTS, where my project is looking at uh, essentially animal movement. Um, but an aspect of animal movement that I'm interested in is animal movement and connectivity, in particular the connections between an animal's home territory and where it goes to reproduce. Um, and in that regard, I'm looking at or you know, trying to find where rabbit fish aggregate to spawn, because at the current time we don't have any information about where a lot of those species reproduce and how they reproduce. Fundamental biological process and we don't know how or where or when it happens. So I'm going to be following the fish in real time, tracking them using uh, little acoustic transmitting devices in the fish and follow them to their spawning grounds and then hopefully document the process of spawning and reproduction in these fishes. Um, and that will help us understand more about the connectivity between where they migrate to and their home, home area of reef. These are tropical marine fishes and they live on coral reefs around the world. Um, and obviously it's important to understand the connection between reef and other environments so that we don't disrupt that connectivity as we are developing areas, particularly reef areas, for tourism and living and uh, industry. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. And why rabbit fish? Why rabbit fish? Because they're a fascinating family of fishes and nobody studies them so they're neglected. <laughs> um, they're really, really interesting fish. Uh, they're very important fish as well. We eat them. Um, not so much here in Australia but in many parts of the Indo-Pacific. They're a main part of the fisheries catch so they support a lot of particularly coastal lagoon or reef communities in developing parts of the world. A very good source of protein, very high in protein. Um, but they're also ecologically important, so they're herbivorous fishes that control algal, algal growth on reefs. Um, so yeah, they have a dual importance. And so yeah, I think it's about time we understood how and where and when they're reproducing. Thank you. <laughs> okay.